Welcome back to Life is Strange True Colors. Oh, I was gonna change the quality, oh, but um, that wasn't a good idea. Okay, well, <laughs> that is how it is how it is. I just tried to be like, oh, maybe 60 FPS would be would be enough, so my PC doesn't overwork itself. But well, still want to hit the trails later this week. Are you was... kidding? I've been waiting for this all year. I have a few favorites we can start with, and then we'll go from there. All right. Peak? So many random yep. people on here. And... We're gonna talk with these guys. It's getting better for sure. She's feeling sadness. Haven is nice. Just wish it felt like home. Hope we both get there soon. Okay, so. Uh, I could talk to him again. Miss Chad. My dad was. Miss Chad. My dad was in the service. Thought I unlocked like a new dialogue option. Miss Chad. My dad was in the service. Or maybe um, in a dialogue with him. Oh, why is he feeling angry? Damn boys, always fighting. Time to grow up. Should have seen Gabe go at it with Dad. He's come a long way. Chad? Oh, first aid kid. Wow. Tetanus anyone? I hope Brian's got better supplies. Behind that mountain man beard, Jed's so obviously a sweet guy. True. Hey, Jed. Yeah? I've got an order from Ducky and Diane. Oh, Go ahead. right. I forgot. Oh, fuck. Uh... Oh god, how? No. One cheeseburger with mushrooms. Hopefully with mushrooms and not without mushrooms. Uh-huh, and? Oh god. Uh... Pie special with mushrooms probably and cheeseburger without mushrooms. Crap. Sorry. I think I've forgotten the order. No, don't, don't get angry with me. Are you sure you've been a server before? That's right. Hmm. Ducky asked for his usual? Yeah, he did. Yeah, he's fond of a particular rye whiskey. I keep a personal bottle for him. Jet looks oh, like... Oh, that's odd. Jet looks like Billy Eilish's I don't dad. see it. <laughs> they have the same oh, beard. Oh, now wait. They have the same face. I bet Ducky took that bottle upstairs last night. Yeah, he and Gabe went on carousing long after closing. You have to look upstairs? Oh, yeah? Yeah. Serves him right if you ask me. But feel free to go upstairs and look for it. I'm sure he'd be grateful. Okay, upstairs is back to my apartment. Oh, if you can't find it, Deputy Pike was with them. Might have some idea. He's usually in here around now. Probably arriving soon. Okay, wait, do I have to ask them for their order again? There must be something around the Black Lantern that can help me find Ducky's prized whiskey. Ducky? Jed thinks you took your whiskey up to Gabe's yesterday. Do you know where you might have left it? <sighs> I remember absolutely nothing of the night. Oh, amazing. <laughs> really? Maybe check your phone. Did you take any pictures? Call anyone? Have a look. Okay, I have to check his phone. Wow. For goodness sake. How do I access the photos on this thing? I want to read his mails. Nice. Oh, wait, it's a different language, right? No. Jet. Okay, that's a name. Poor Ducky. I shouldn't be reading this. I am. It has been e it has been easy being your has not been easy being your daughter. You cannot simply say you're lonely and expect that I will forget my first twenty years. I think about your request. The kids are all doing well. I have shown them a picture of you. Mabel Mabel McAllister. How am I supposed to find out anything? He was somewhere. There's a picture in the background and he's wearing a helmet. He could be in the mines though. Can't click anything here. Sorry. Nothing useful. Well, thanks for letting me know. 
All right. My dad was in the service. Okay, I want to check out some more things here though before I go upstairs and look for the whiskey. Venison and leek pie. I need to try that. No idea what any of that means. Leek pie sounds disgusting. <laughs> oh, hey. Someone made a course about my life. Oh. Radical acceptance. Finding gratitude in the midst of chaos. <laughs> Treasure of Tibet. Photos. Are there any pictures of our brother on here? Maybe. This one's from yesterday. Hold up. It was Colonel Ducky on Gabe's couch with the bottle. Okay, I see, I see. Is that just a hole? <laughs> Can I check out the thing? Damn. I wonder if the bullet's still in there. Here, Jack Henry shot at William Porter over four aces and paid with his life. Damn. Guess these were for mining. Aww. Blessing caps, keep dry. Spams generic, a John run company, keep dry. Mobs blessing company, high safety, a high dangerous match for fast detonation. Please use caution, clear air before lightning. Okay, okay, okay. Maybe I'll see a circus one day. Once I'm better with crowds. Uh, we should not support support circus. <laughs> Restaurant review. Unusually personable staff. Nicely done, big bro. Uh, Boulder Weekend, the Black Lantern, Pop First, Soft Ride, American Dollar, 3.7 food for the two decor service, a menu of standard pop fare, serviceable, serviceably prepared with occasional standout specials is elevated by unusual personal stuff, exceptional service, and quirky patrons, creating a, un a uniquely uplifting experience for over the drive into remote Haven Springs, Colorado. Oh. Is there anything this woman can't do? Uh, Colorado Canvas by Jessica Martinez. When I met Charlotte Harmon in her home studio last month, both her and her coffee mug were covered in paint. Yes, I'm a cliche, she beamed, and she led me towards her latest creation, a gorgeous portrait of local business owner Eleanor Leaf. Part oil painting, part lacquered bouquet. Very few surfaces in our house are free of paint. I'm okay with that, she continued. Probably familiar with Miss Harmon's work, thanks to a commission from the town council to decorate the walking path of Main Street. The massive outdoor mirror Fittingly tilted, ha titled Haven Springs, captures all a small slice of earth nestled in the Colo Colorado mountains. It was such a wonderful experience, Miss Harmon recalled. Everyone supported me during the process and Jed basically fed my family for months, which was great because the lantern makes the best burger in town. You can print that. Now Miss Harmon is looking to deepen her connection to Haven Springs and start. Wait. And start. Small business. No easy task for a working artist. Oh god, we still have to talk to Mac. If it was him. I don't know. Yeah, it is. Shit. Now Mac's scared. He better be. I made that. At least bitch. he's not freaking out anymore. He won't make me lose control. I made that bitch scared. As he should be. God damn it. So many things to look at. 19 lives? Jed is a real hero. Oh, present with gratitude to Jed Luke and front flagging courage and outstanding devotion to duty in saving the 19 lives of his team. Rotary Club of Haven Springs, 2008. Okay, so that's what Steph meant. Haven seems pretty serious about this festival. Only two spots left in bread baking competition. There are only two spots remaining in the bread baking competition for this year's spring festival. This year's theme is Seeds and Nuts. Interested participants should call Isabel ASAP. The grand prize winner last year was Peter Gowers with a garlic Asiago loaf. Typhoon Mining sponsors raffle for Caribbean cruise. The spring festival will have another raffle this year and the big prize is a seven day cruise in the Caribbean. An airfare is included. The prize was donated by Typhoon Mining. Raffle proceeds but benefit the Haven, Haven Springs Firehouse and Haven Springs Historic Preservation Society. Tickets can be purchased ahead of time at Town Hall or at the festival. Okay, Spencer coupons. Coupons for weed? What a time to be alive. Wow. How mysterious. Amelia Rosam Goldstein. On this side, Amelia, Ro Amelia Goldstein operated a bed and breakfast for nine years. Known for its beautiful rooftop garden, she died at the age of uh, 32 of influenza. 
Though married shortly before her death, the identity of her husband remains a mystery. Hello there. Idiot. You're gonna lose her. You're gonna lose her and it's all your fault. At least he's right about something. Yeah, true. Wow. I messed Mac up pretty good. I'm supposed to check on him, okay, but I can't even talk to him. I can play. I can play games. As G A B. Gabe. Yeah. That's gotta be Gabe, right? Okay, is that the same game as before? Left, right, okay, or left, right, AD, okay. Fire, space. Destroy all bricks, collect power ups, next level. Laser, power up. Force fire lasers, creates an exit. Slow velocity of ball, extends walls, catching ability, earn extra walls, search and splits ball into eight. Alright. Oh, it's like Space Invaders. Oh. I'm retro, but I'm not that retro. What? What? What happened? What's going on? What? Oh, I have to hit them. Okay, I see. Okay, okay. Nice. Dude, these old retro games are like so addicting. Oh! I can't shoot. I got a power up. Getting another power up. Oh, the ball is coming back. Oh, I've gotten bigger. Don't fuck him that. Oh. oh! Jesus! Such a weird game. Wow! Playing video games in a video game. Gladly paid 50 bucks for this game. Can't even shoot! Why did I respawn? What? What happened? Was I good? Um, probably not. Wait, I want to try again. <laughs> I have no idea what is going on here. Alright. Shooting. Uh, this is so me IRL. I would like totally spend the whole time in this bar playing this stupid game here. Until I beat the high score. Which I don't even know if it's possible in the game. Oh fuck. Yes. We get it. Oh fuck. No! Fuck. Okay. I'm still getting my power up though. No! I'm missing it again. I can't shoot! Oh, I shouldn't use my mouse. Round one ready. Okay, that was just a warm up. All right. I want to beat this for once without going game over. I want to know if there is a second stage to this as well. Come on. Come on. Oh, going good so far. Going amazing. Whoa. And cannot get hit. Oh, I destroyed it. One up. I only have one life. Fuck. Come on. Give me. Yes. Can I? I need to hit those things. But I won't reach it. Come on. Got it. Uh, high score. How, who do, how do people get so many points in this? 50k? What the fuck, man? I only got like 6k. Oh, get it. Get it. Get it, yes. 
Give me everything. I'm gonna do this. I wanna play Sonic Spinball. Oh fuck. Yeah, give me more points. I did it! Oh my god. Second stage, we're here. Let's go. Okay, but how did... Oh, my score is still going. Okay, okay. I thought this was only the high score for this one level. Fuck. How? No! Oh, okay. Round two ready. The sounds are so addictive. No! Okay, I have one life left, one life left. Let's do this. Concentration. I'm a pro gamer. Oh. Fuck. Dude, the stage was so weird because all of my balls that I gain just instantly fall down. But it's not gonna stop me. I won't stop from zero. I'm so getting fired. I'm so getting fired, man. That's why I don't go to work. Oh! Sure know how to waste my time. How many lives do I have? I wanna beat the high score! Did it get game over? I got a game over, okay. Okay. Sure you'd like to quit the arcade? Yeah. Oh, I have to use my mouse again. Can I? Alright. Time to clean up the bottles. Oh, don't fucking touch me. So, stay away. Holy shit. What do you want? Can I talk to you real quick? No. No way. Come on, please. Okay, he doesn't sound like a total this jerk now. What happened upstairs was fucked up, right? From both of us. Mm, your fault, though. That is bullshit. And you know it. I was defending Gabe from you. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> He's so scared. I'm gonna piss your pants. Look, Riley's headed over here. She's pretty heated. I, I, I don't think it helps to recap all the gory details, you know? Are you trying to threaten me? <laughs> you really are a piece of shit. True. Look, she's gonna break up with me otherwise. I don't care. We've been together four years. She deserves better than you. She is the best thing that's ever happened to me. Sure is. So please, help me out. No, you're toxic boyfriend. You're just abusing her. How in the I, fuck? I don't know, man. No. Shit. She's here? What the fuck is wrong with you? Oh my god. Look at your face. No, it's okay. She knows how he is. Don't even. What were you thinking? Where's Gabe? Okay, so she knows about the incident. Why do you give a shit? Oh, come on. Because my boyfriend just got into a fight with him. I swear. This is it. You better have a good explanation or... We're done. I'm not gonna lie for him, even though if he comes for me, I've got it's, big balls. It's not my fault. I just wanted to talk to the guy. About what? About you! About why you guys are meeting behind my back. That's bullshit, he's paranoid. Okay. So how did the fight happen? The bastard sucker punched me. Okay, um... Not exactly sucker punched, <laughs> but... He definitely started it. He didn't. I mean, I can't remember, oh, but God. he didn't. 
Were you there too? <laughs> no. Yeah. Avoid for a trouble call out Max bullshit. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah, I was there. Max telling you a whole lot of bullshit. You can't rely on me, piece of shit. You almost killed my brother. You know what? That doesn't even surprise me anymore. So what really happened? Riley. Mac barged in, accused Gabe of sleeping with you, sucker punched him, and then kicked him while he was down. Riley, listen. What happened to Mac's face? I punched him. I did that. Well, good. It sounds like he deserved yeah. it. Yeah. Thanks for telling me the truth. I told y'all I'll make you single. Wait. Wait, are you, are we okay? Riley's mine. Are you fucking serious? I'm so embarrassed by you right now. But are we still together? So pathetic. What do you think, you fucking idiot? No. Just hope he doesn't hurt her. Alex Chen? Oh. Uh. Assaulting Mac Loudon on your first day here, huh? I'm sorry. He deserved it. I'm Jason Pike, the deputy sheriff. I'm gonna have to take you in for questioning. For real, though? I thought he would be like, oh, uh, yeah, uh, he deserved it. Also, this guy in the German dub is voiced by a very famous YouTuber, by a very famous German YouTuber, Kronk, if you know. Mac assaulted Gabe. He's the one you want. Don't tell me it's his son. Don't tell me it's his son. No. <coughs> okay. Thanks. Your face. <laughs> you should see your face. Oh, jeez. <laughs> no, I'm only kidding. Uh, nobody's in trouble here. I... <laughs> Gabe and I just like to prank each other. <laughs> okay, yeah, this role suits the guy. YouTuber, well revealed. I've never been pranked by a cop before. <laughs> you definitely got me. <laughs> Thanks for being a good sport. Can I buy you a drink? Um, maybe. I'm working right now. Well, I'll be at the bar. You want one, you just come by, okay? No one's working like- No one's wearing like any work outfits. How are you supposed to know who's working here and who's not? Kind of weird that we don't hear her in her thoughts after a scene like this, because normally you would hear what people are talking about, like, oh shit, how did I just get away with this, or, like, I don't know. Can I go upstairs? I can't read my own mind, my own rant, oh. can't talk, can't read my own mind, even though that should be the only mind that I am supposed to read. However... All right. Let's see if I can find Ducky's whiskey up here. Okay, it should be somewhere next to the sofa, I think. Because that's where the picture was taken. Oh, I think I see it. Oh, it's, is it not the one here? No? Okay, maybe not. Come out, sneaky little bottle of liquor. Ducky's whiskey could be one of those. Maybe. I don't know. This all looks really fancy, but no rye whiskey. Oh, fuck. Maybe in the bathroom, the only room which we don't have access to. In the couch, maybe. Probably. Come on. Please be in here. Oh, <laughs> I got it. Read. Straight rye whiskey, small batch. Yay. Let's go. I got myself a bottle of whiskey in the couch. I'm going down to Black Lantern. Found this upstairs. In Gabe's couch? What a relief! Nice and warm. Many thanks, Enjoy your drink. Alex. My pleasure, Ducky. Can I pour you a glass? Uh, no, no. Allow me. Is he pouring me a glass? All right. To Miss Alex Chen, a most tenacious detective. To Alex. Cheers. Cute. <laughs> oh. <sighs> what? You guys are I've done high. What Jed asked me to do. I should see if he needs anything else. Okay, Ayo. Ayo, why are you walking away from me? He is still angry. 
Wait, what's with this guy? Oh, that's Pike! But I cannot look. Okay, now I can look. Damn, was that Frank out of line? Did I come on too strong? He it was bold. I'll give you that. Seems like a good person. I can't help it. I still tense up whenever I see a uniform. Probably because something happened in the past. Maybe she killed someone because oh, of her, like, God. rage. Like, you never know. Hey, Alex. Uh... Ready for that drink? I'm ready to take you up on that drink. Alright. Wait, hey, Jed, can we get, uh... <laughs> Thanks. And keep it quick. She's on the clock. <laughs> <laughs> you know, your brother's been talking about you getting here for months. I'm starting to get the sense. I even remember exactly the day he found your number. He was telling everybody in this place. Oh, cute. Really? Yeah. Pretty heartwarming stuff. Well, I've got to get back to work. Later, Alex. Yeah, I hope Chad knows that I'm also doing some work and not just lazing around here. How can I run? I can't run. Are you finished up with everything you want to do? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I took care of everything you mentioned. Is there anything else you'd like me to do? Nah, the boys should be back soon. Here they are. Well, speak of the devil. Called it. How you feeling? Not great. Not awful. No, what happened? I got Alex covering for you. For real? <laughs> we need to talk. I'll be on the rooftop, okay? Oh, he's got a rooftop. Okay. I think that's enough for today. I don't know what kind of place you worked at before, but you got a ways to go. I'm sorry, man. You can't keep an injured man waiting. You better go upstairs. Thanks. We'll see you tomorrow. Injured man. Okay. Time to talk to Gabe. She's talking about Mac because I sure as hell took care of that. Officially, two hour warning. Typhon mining will be detonating charges in two hours. Oh, I hope that's not gonna be like an earthquake here. If you are in a marked danger zone, you must begin clearing out now. Call our 24 hour safety line with any questions of co or concerns. Poster has disabled any replies. All right. Yo, welcome back to Life is Strange, True Colors. In the last episode, we started working in the bar, and now we're meeting our brother on the rooftop. Which is looking way prettier than I thought. Wow. What a beautiful scenery. And everything is peaceful. How's your jaw? Silent treatment. How is your jaw? How's your jaw? Pain bad? Oh, I thought you would just Look, leave. Look, Gabe, I'm really sorry. I... I'll drink some beer. I mean, I knew he wouldn't be like mad at us because he seemed like he's used to it, even though she said in the beginning that her brother doesn't know about any of her issues. Do you have a cooler under there? I like to hide beers around the house. Because, well, you never know. You never know what? You just. 
Never know. Never know when you need a beer. So, need a manager for your underground cage fighting career? Gabe, I'm really sorry. How many bones have you broken? Like, on other people? Dude, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. Don't apologize. I'm fine. Now that we're talking about it. Oh no. He's gonna ask us about our past. Guess I never realized. I'm crazy. I can kick your ass. <laughs> that I can kick your ass? Yeah, I guess. You know, I never realized what your life must have been like. We still don't. On your own. Still don't know why they got separated in the first place. It was fine. You know, when I pulled you off the Mac and you hit me, I, I was angry. Then I thought about how you took him apart. Like you've done it before. Wait, he went to juvenile? Didn't you go to juvie? Isn't that like prison? What did he do? What the fuck? Yeah. That was the hardest time in my life. Some days that I didn't think I'd make it out. He seems like the nicest person ever. Why was he in there? But I get the feeling you've been through worse. Maybe. I can tell there's something going on with you. Something troubling you. Maybe it's time you open up. Getting flashbacks to Life is Strange. I want to talk to Gabe, but what can I even say right now to explain what happened with Mac? This feels like when Chloe and Max are sitting on the bench looking down on Arcadia Bay and Max decides to tell Chloe about her powers. Tell him about your power, tell him about your past. I want to know about her past. So I'm probably going with that. Just because I'm really interested in what happened. Growing up in the system was hell. In my first foster home, an older boy followed me into the bathroom. So I pushed him out. He got angry. So did I. Then I broke his nose. I was 14. In the second home, one of the other kids committed suicide. And I couldn't eat for a month. After a couple of weeks in the fifth home, I got so depressed that my new parents sent me to a hospital. I never saw him again. Mm -hmm. The hurt follows me everywhere. It's the other kids get adopted, leave the system. Not me. They never picked me. I'm broken. Do you really believe that? Today I do wouldn't you? It's so sad. Also, by the way, I get the feeling that episode one is ending soon, so I might not even have the time to finish this episode with, like, a long, normal time. <laughs> but, like, it's so sad to, like, think of it that, like, it's like puppies in a shelter. Because I had to, just, just had to think of, like, uh, the show Once Upon a Time. Uh, you know, with, like, all the Disney characters from, like, fairy tales and stuff there was also like the main character was also an orphan and she said something similar to what Alex just said with like why would they never pick me and like just thinking about this it's like such a 
it's such a weird idea because it makes you feel like people aren't human because they're like deciding to prefer other people over other people while everyone in this place needs like help and like a better a better future and like someone who's guiding them for life and you see all these people getting preferred getting picked over you and then you're just sitting there and be like what is wrong with me why won't they have me because like you know you know like these ideas when you think of like puppies from the shelter or something but like that is actually like not too different to what is happening to some humans wouldn't you wouldn't you After all this time, it's hard not to take it personally. And it just keeps happening. It never stops. You're in a safe space now, Alex. Then I look at you. You've got a home, a job, a girlfriend. You've got it all figured out. And I don't. It's gonna happen, though. We're living here, we made friends, we have our own home. We're living with our brother. I don't want to smoke now. I don't need a light. Just take it. Kitty, kitty cat. Oh. What is this? I'm gonna cry. A reminder. Looks like a match to me. That was the last matchbook I got when I was still in juvie. Did some pretty unsavory stuff to score it. And you still have it? Yeah. I carry it with me everywhere. When I got out, I went through the last few matches real quick, obviously, but... I, I could never bring myself to use the last one. It reminded me how bad life got. And how much better I was going to make it. Gabe, I can't accept this if it means so much to you. No, no, that's exactly why I want you to keep it. Thoughts of what I wanted him to say it himself. <laughs> that's cute. When I found Haven and Charlotte, I couldn't believe they were real. Everything before was such hell. Now it's different. You can do the same. Start a new life. You made it out of the system, Alex. You survived. It's time to move on. It's not that simple. I've made so many mistakes. We all have. Survival isn't a neat and tidy process. But it's way better than the alternative. And don't forget, I'm here to help you. It's not gonna change. Oh, I'm kind of tearing up. <laughs> I really like Gabe. He's such a sweet personality. So. When were you going to tell me about the guitar? Oh, shit. You found it. It was supposed to be a huge surprise. Surprise? <laughs> First day? Well? What do you think? Loving it! I love it. Thank you so much. Why does this action have consequences? Oh, God. Welcome home. Welcome home. Oh, Ryan. Okay. Oh, hey, dude, what's I up? I thought it was Mac for a second. Hey. Got scared here. Is Ethan up here? No. He was heading Oh, home. no, he went to the mine. He was, but I haven't seen him in a oh, while. Oh, no. He ran away because we busted him. You don't Shit, think... I messed up. Maybe? Fuck, maybe he did. What is it? 
I think he went up to the mountains. If he actually did, we need to move. Oh, now. the blasting is gonna Let's be today, go. isn't it? Fuck. 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 Oh god, now everything felt peaceful for a second, but now it feels like everything is gonna get worse in the next few minutes, and I do not like this feel. soon.